Rosemary Pool is frequently a staple in some Needham residents' summer plans. Ashley Julier spoke with the Director of Park and Recreation, Patty Carey, to find out everything you need to know about the Needham destination. Rosemary Pool opened last Tuesday for the season and will be open until August 26. Our general swim hours are 12.30 in the afternoon till 7.45 at night. During the morning, which you see behind me, are swimming lessons, and we'll also have um, our swim team that will be practicing throughout the day. We're open seven days a week, so Saturdays and Sundays also. And on July 4th, we're free to everybody, so we hope people will come down after the parade and join us for some fun, including some fun swim team events at 2 o'clock. Swim lessons are held in two-week sessions, so they just started this week, so we're in week one of, of four sessions and you can register online or in our office. We have uh, levels, uh, preschool level one up to four, and then we have some stroke clinics. We have a high school conditioning program that we're doing, plus we have the swim team. A unique aspect of Rosemary Pool is it is surrounded by nature rather than cement. It's a beautiful site here. We have the lake. We always have nature crawling around. We have turtles and birds and ducks and fish jumping out of the water. So it's just a fun place. We also have beach on either end so they can dig in the sand or play beach volleyball on the far beach. So there's a lot of fun things to do. Plus you're with people from the Needham community that are your friends that you don't get to see very often. And the great thing about Rosemary Pool is if you're a young baby, you can sit with your parents in the water, a toddler can walk in the water, but you can be 95 years old and be swimming or water walking too. So we have all ages, which is a great opportunity. It's not a one age place. Rosemary Pool offers more than just swimming during its Friday Family of Fun Nights. Starting after 6 o'clock on these Friday nights, we have um, special fun activities. We stretch the rules a little bit. We get the guards. Some of them are guarding, but some are off the chairs doing activities with um, children or parents, um, families, whoever wants to participate. Um, each week has a theme, so July 1st will be all about the 4th of July and a lot of um, red, white, and blue activities happening. And the activities are in the water and out of the water, and they're all free. It's just the admission, either your season pass or your daily admission coming in, but you don't have to pay to participate. And the staff really looks forward to it because they, they get to have, do some fun things with children instead of always being in their chair and blowing their whistles on things. So it's, it's good for everybody. Rosemary Pool was originally built to be used for 10 years while they cleaned the lake. However, it has lasted many more decades past its expected use. 45 years is a long time for a facility, and as wonderful as Rosemary Pool is, it's really tired and in need of something new. So we've been working for the past few years on a design project to redesign what you see behind me, which is one large rectangle with many sections, and develop two pools. And our hope is to start construction sometime during the summer of 2017 so we can be ready for a full season in 2018 with a new facility and a new building. For more information on Rosemary Pool, go to needhamma.gov slash park and recreation. For the Needham Channel News, I'm Ashley Julier.